What's up, YouTubers? Diego with little designs. Here's my stereo. Took it apart. <laughs> uh, I already went over how to take this Honda apart. And today we have this baby. So, uh, the only thing I didn't show y'all was how I got this module apart from the face plate. So basically there's a bunch of screws that were here. Uh, you have I think one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, I'm sorry, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven or eight screws. Um, along with that you have, um, you need to pop off these knobs. Uh, once you got the knobs then you'll be able to pop the, the whole the whole chipboard out. Um, now, these you do need to use a soldering iron. It would be a lot to do. This is a lot of work for such a little um, improvement. Uh, basically, I have a bunch of LEDs here. Uh, I you get the Neo Wedge. That's what they're called. Um, these are old ones right here. But these are the new ones. I have some more in here. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to just basically kind of hack it up. Um, put my own LEDs inside here. Now the one thing you got to know. Um, well this. This was right here. Um, you have to desolder one of these edges. Um, other than that they have little locking tabs. You just got to straighten them out and they pop out. Um, but one of the one of the corners has to be desoldered, uh, and that's when I noticed that it comes with two two bulbs in here that power up or that light up the the LCD there, um, which is cool because I can change it into a white instead of the orange, the ugly orange that it has. Um, one thing though is whenever you do use um, these neo wedges, whatever. What they'll have is they'll have a, a resistor on attached to it, kind of like this. Oh god, it's not gonna show. There's a resistor. Um, let me see if I can point to you. on this end right here, the top end. This is a micro resistor or kind of a micro one. Um, so that resistor goes on the actual. When you turn it, when you when you're gonna solder it so like this this is a one point right here uh, if you follow the leads it actually follows to a, a SMD resistor which uh, that is a negative side so you want to follow this resistor you want it to have that resistor in line with that one um, because if you go the other way it's not going to turn on so the positive needs to flow, flow freely and then the negative side will be the what's resisting uh, I believe that's what it is. Um, I already tested it out and it's working fine. Uh, the only thing is I had blue and I didn't realize it was blue. I, I had, thought it was white. So you have one, two, three, four, five, six, and then the two mini ones um, that I already took off. So seven, eight, eight, uh, where is it at? Oh, seven and then eight right here. Once again, you have one, two, three, four, five, six that it took off, seven in here, and then eight right here. Um, I will show y'all how it looks afterwards. Uh, for now, it's going to take me a bit to kind of desolder and solder and fit them in there. Um, I think it'll be worth it. It kind of updates the, the Honda that I have a bit more. Um, makes it look a lot better a little bit more newer so in terms my 2006 will turn into a 2010 <laughs> all right we'll keep watching and subscribe all right thanks guys laters